My name is Howard Berry. I'm the father of the late Staff Sergeant Joshua Berry. My son died of wounds that were sustained during the first Fort Hood shooting. You won't find Josh listed among the killed or wounded. He didn't exist. The Army forgot about him. As the fifth anniversary of the first Fort Hood shooting approaches, I'd like to remind you of the sacrifices that were made on November 5th, 2009. Nadal Hassan murdered 13 and wounded 32. Did you know that men and women from 23 different states were killed or wounded? Did you know that this shooting has been classified a random act of violence in the workplace? Did you know that the victims and their families are still waiting for the truth to be told? Simply put, this shooting was a terrorist act. This has become a domestic Benghazi. Did you know that Senate Bill 1500, honoring the Fort Hood Heroes Act, was introduced a year ago? It was written in an effort to honor the victims and to tell the truth. And I don't understand. I don't understand why Senator Blunt has not co-sponsored this legislation. Did you know that one of the victims is from Missouri? Kira Bona Porkelson, one of the soldiers that was wounded. She's in my stego. Why did Senator Blunt turn his back on one of his own constituents? Why has he failed to support some of the very people who volunteered to stand between us and our enemies? I do know that my son fought for all Americans. I believe in supporting our troops. I believe that support should be more than a yellow ribbon decal on the back of our car or thank you for your service to our country or, or sadder yet, sorry for your loss. I believe supporting our troops requires action. I am humbly asking the good people of Missouri to support the troops with their action. Contact Senator Blunt. Please ask him why he didn't support the victims from the first Ford Hood shooting. Ask Senator Blunt why he didn't co-sponsor Senate Bill 1500. It's the right thing to do. It tells the truth. God bless. I miss my son.